Julian's got a ladybug on her shoulder. Just like, I get, it's the one from my hair moved to her shoulder. Ew. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back. I'm back with Heather, and today we are hiking Halasan at the San Panak Trail. We're gonna do some stretching, and then we're gonna start hiking up. In addition to Heather, Julia is gonna be on the hike too today. No. So it should be a beautiful, the beautiful day. The air quality is super clear today, huh? We've been waiting for the perfect day. For yeah, a while. we've been waiting for the perfect day, and I think today is that day. Oh, let's see. Let's see the Maliki Makali. Oh, mm. camera photo shoot. <laughs> <laughs> we made a friend, Mr. Kim. Oh, an enemy. Just his oh I know. He, he offered us a orange. He offered you an orange. Okay, he offered, oh, he offered me an orange. <laughs> and, I fin and, it. and I finished it. And right, it's biodegradable, right? <laughs> I threw the peels off to the side. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, no, like Nathan said, we'll start a tangerine. I said that. Oh, you said that. <laughs> Juliet said that that we're gonna start a uh, tangerine. That we're gonna start a tangerine farm, farm up here on Halasan. <laughs> what, what what are we at right now? One point nine. One point nine. Okay, one point nine, and that's probably how many? Out of how many? Out of. Oh, the total was like nine point something, right? Yeah, it's like nine, nine point, point something uh, kilometers. So we still have three and a half hours to go. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're about an hour and a half in, and this is the first break we've had through the brush and the sun is just coming through. Look at that sky. It is, I don't know if you can see, it is blue sky, t blue sky today. Oh, ah, just breathing in that fresh air. There's no pollution today. No pollution today. Oh, check out my nice shiny forehead. It's a good workout. <sighs> Julia and Nathan are ahead of me. Heather's behind me. We kind of split up, but we're almost there. Almost there. So after about mm, maybe two, two and a half hours, we made it to the last resting stop. And we're gonna try some makgeolli and some kimbap. Heather and I are enjoying some kimbap. This kimbap is actually really good today. But it's like squished. Yeah, it's a little squished from our bag, but it's still really good. And then Juliet and Nathan, you guys made your burritos, yeah? So what is it, Juliet? It's a ladybug. I don't know if you can see it. There it is. What is it? It's a ladybug. In my hair? Yeah, ew. Oh, and your sweat, too. You sweat. <laughs> ladybug caught in my sweat in my hair. Is that good luck? I'm going to say it's good luck. And I don't know if you guys can see, but from here, the summit of Halasan is right there. We're almost there. Almost there. <laughs> So we finally made it to the top of Halasan. Here, ready? Ooh. Beautiful. We yeah. made it! <laughs> got a ladybug. Oh, <laughs> and Julian's got a ladybug on her shoulder. Just like, I get, it's the one from my hair moved to her shoulder. Ew. <laughs> the one that on you. Uh, it's beautiful. You can see there's not much, there's like a very little amount of water. So I'm thinking that during the monsoon season is when it fills up. Still pretty though. In the distance, way over there, that's Jeju City. That's where we live. I just tripped on a step. So we live in Jeju City, and the famous city on the other side of Jeju Island is Sogipo. And you can see Sogipo right now. It's a little cloudy and a little smoggy today, but Sogipo is right down there. I do show a lot of beautiful things here on Jeju Island. However, there is something that I keep trying to avoid, and that is the smog. Jeju Island is beautiful, and there's a lot of beautiful things here. However, I'm not gonna lie that there isn't pollution because there is, and it's becoming a big problem. So if you look out here, 
It almost looks like a marine layer, but that's not a marine layer. That's actually a layer of smog. It's not too bad today. Today's actually a pretty good day. So I just wanted to point that out that it is beautiful here. However, there are days when the pollution can get kind of bad. So, but I'm just happy today is a clearer day. Heather and I have started our descent on the Guan Um Sa side of a different trail. And Julia and Nathan I uh, went down back down Song Panak uh, because that's where they have their scooter. So we're being a little more adventurous today. The views on this side are incredible. Look at that over there. And then right over here, that is the crater. All right, we got a long ways to go. We did it! Oh my god! After 8 hours and 18.5 kilometers I believe, we have made it through Holosan. Once you finally make it out of the hiking trail, there are these hoses that you can use to clean your shoes. It's a great way to get some dirt off if you're going to get back in your car or wherever you're going. And you'll see these through most trails in Korea, especially here on Jeju Island. Heather just ran across the street to grab some water. She's really thirsty. One tip is if you're going to hike Holosan, make sure that, that you start hiking as early as possible. Today we started at 7 a.m. If you can make it up at 6.30 a.m., that's even better. This is because there it can get really crowded and you can beat the crowd. So definitely try to come as early as possible. Thanks again for watching, guys, and remember to live every moment to the max. I'll see you guys next time.